Hey guys, how's it going? It's me. It's Saturday now. It is about 9 o'clock at night. It is the final day of VidCon. I'm so sad that it's already fucking over. It seemed like just yesterday I got here. And now it's almost time to go fucking home and back to reality where everything sucks. And back to work and and bills and yucky things. Well, the only good thing I'll have to go home to is my kitty. At least I'll have that. I miss her. But anyways, um today was was pretty good. Um oh, I mean, I had something so cool um happen. I was um I was walking around and I actually ran into Steve Green who was doing interviews with um Cat Lauer. I was like I was like, "Oh my god, I got to jump on this shit." So quickly, I pull out Scarlet, right? And I so wanted him to fucking interview. I wanted it so fucking bad, but he his arm was so fucking tired and he was going to go take a break, right? So right before he left, I said, "Hey Steve." I said, "Is there any way um Scarlet can get a picture with Cat Lauer and kiss him on the cheek. And he's like, sure. And it was funny because in the picture, he just kind of looked off into another direction. And meanwhile, me and Scarlet are in the picture um, with Cat Lauer, which was, it was fucking hilarious. Because when I walked up, I, I waved at it, Scarlet waved at him, and he was like, what the fuck is that? And she, you know, she was like, I'm a red panda. And, da, da, da. and he's like, really? It was, it was so funny. It was really, really funny. Because I think at one point Scarlett said she wanted to have Cat Lauer's babies or something. Could have happened. I'm not sure. Not totally sure. But anyways, um, one of the other things that happened that was really funny is I remember at one point I tweeted Michael Gallagher. And I said, I said, fuck. I was like, I, I forgot to bring my smiley ticket. And I was pretty, I, well, I wanted to say, so if you see me, you better fucking run the other way. Because if I see you, I'm going to be so fucking mad. But I didn't. I actually didn't say the last part. And sure enough, what happens? I run into him. And I was just like, mother of a dick cock, fuck. I, I, was, I was mad. I was so mad. But, um, but hopefully he's going to be at Shane's movie premiere too. So hopefully... Knock on wood. <laughs> Hopefully I'll remember to bring the tickets to Vince so I can have him sign it. But anyway, so it was really it was really awesome seeing him because I haven't seen M Michael in like two years. I, I only saw him at VidCon 2012, I think. Or it might have even been 2011. I don't know. It was one out of two. But anyway, so it was cool seeing him. I also finally got to meet Craig Dillon. Um... Unfortunately, poor Lisa Bug was sick, sick with the flu, so I didn't get to see Lisa, but that was okay. Oh, and it, this was fucking funny. I went to, I went to the panel. It was Andre, uh, the, what is it, what is he called? The, uh, the black, uh, the black nerd. God, I can't, oh God. His name's Andre, but I, I just can't think of what his actual title is. It's something with nerd in it. I, I, I'm just completely brain farting right now. But I'll just call him Andre since that is in fact his name. Okay, so it was supposed to have been Andre, Shauna, and Lisa. But unfortunately, like I said, Lisa was home with the flu. So it was just, first it was just Shauna. Andre actually showed up fashionably late, like a typical man. Can't even be on time for his own fucking panel. But anyway... So I'm sitting there in the front row and Shauna's like, you know, asking us all questions and shit. And finally Andre showed up and we all berated him and gave him a hard time for being fucking late and shit. And I, I, um, I was raising my hand to ask a question and Shauna looked and she's like, oh girl, she's like, she's like, Janet, I ain't going to skip you. And I was just, I, gra I, she gave me the microphone and I was all, <coughs> I was all, God, I love how everybody knows me by name. It's like, oh, I was like, oh, I'm such a fucking celebrity. Oh, my God. I'm so, I'm so famous. Oh, my God. And, um, and basically, I, I asked them essentially the same question. But I asked Andre, um, 
what the most awkward um, situation that he ever encountered with Lisa. Because Lisa and him worked together a lot on uh, Popaholics, I think it was called. And I said, so what was the most aw weird, awkward thing that happened between, awkward moment between you two? And he said they were doing a Wrecking Ball parody. And instead of Lisa being on the Wrecking Ball, Andre was practically naked on the, on the Wrecking Ball. <laughs> Not something I, I want to relive. Just playing Andre. You know I love you. And then I asked Shauna essentially the same question, but about her and Shane. And she was just like, Phew. she's like, where do I start? She had like tons of things. But, um, God, I can't even remember what the last one was that, that she finally ended up going with. She went with something. Oh, oh, I remember what one of them was, is I guess when they were doing Smiley, um, they were playing Truth or Dare, and I guess someone dared Shauna to kiss Shane or something. And, and she was saying that was really awkward. And then we, everybody was like, damn, is there anybody you haven't kissed? And then Andre was standing there going, <clears throat> and then she... Shauna went up and kissed him. It was it was very, it was a very special. It was a very special moment. But um, but yeah, it it was pretty it was pretty funny. It was pretty pretty damn funny. But um, other than that, nothing. I met a few other people here and there. I finally found Jory Karen. I fi I finally got Caleb Nation, and um, I also want to give a shout out to Cliff from the Hilton. And I just want to say, I hope you get laid someday. There's your shout out. Ta-da! Because um, Cliff was actually nice enough to actually hook me up, and I actually was able to get into the lobby of the Hilton today. So um, that was really cool. Luckily, I didn't, like I said, I didn't, I didn't get kicked out because I pretty much stayed in one place when I got in there. Like, I went to the bar, bought a Mai Tai, and I, like, I, like, slammed it because <laughs> I, I didn't want to risk getting, if they did catch me and were going to toss me out, I wanted to make sure I finished my drinky poo, <sighs> which was a bad idea because I got really buzzed after that. But anyway, but I digress. <clears throat> but, um, and then it's like I kept saying, Jory, Jory, where are you? Jory, Jory. Jordan Karen, where the fuck are you, bitch? <laughs> and then he he uh, tweets me back and he says, I'm at the Andrew's Q&A. And Andrew is Gunnarola and Andrew Hong. My little Canadian, my little Canadian bacon boys. And I was just like, man, I don't want to risk leaving the Hilton lobby because then I won't be able to get back in. But then I was sitting in there. There really wasn't anybody in there anyway. So I just kind of finished my drink and... I started heading over there, and that's, like I said, where I ran into Totally Sketch and stuff, which was pretty cool. And uh, and so, yeah, so I got to see the Andrews also, you know, and and I was just like, gonna roll it. It's, I, it's like, he's like, it's been a couple years. And I was like, it's like, yeah, I haven't seen you since you stole my Sharpie. Because he stole my Sharpie one year. I was fucking livid. He's a little sharp, sharpy, stealing poo poo head. Let the record show that. Hashtag Gunnarola is a, a sharpy, stealing poo poo head. But anyway. <coughs> so I finally got my picture with Jory. I got to say what's up to Yara. You know, um, pretty much just kind of walked around, chilled for a while. You know, all that fun stuff. And uh, right now. It's a little after nine. Uh, after I'm done with this video, I'm probably going to head over to <coughs> the arena and uh, go check out the concert and stuff like that. Oh, one other cool thing that actually happened um, yesterday, actually, was that the, when I went to the concert yesterday, because I actually went back to the concert um, <coughs> because Jory said he was on the dance floor. So I, I was in my, my PJs. And I quickly got dressed again and went down there, but I could not find Jory Karen to save my life. I was I was so livid, but it was all good because Drew actually showed up. He showed up down um, 
at the concert and I was like, Drew. And he was like, oh my God. He's like, we've totally got to take a picture. And he, he actually wanted to take it on his phone, but I was like, no, 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 let's take it on my phone. My phone's, my phone's a Galaxy S5. Ugh. It's, and it's fabulous. It, it takes, it takes perfect pictures, you know. Don't, don't ask me why I keep going into Paris Hilton. I, I just kind of automatically do it if I'm being sassy or facetious or a bitch, you know. But anyway, so we took this really cute picture. And then I remember tweeting Shane saying, oh, I hope you saw the picture. And he was like, duh, I see everything. It's like, oh, and I was like, oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot you stalked my Twitter and my Facebook. What was I thinking? Ugh. But, um, <coughs> um, oh, and I also did some other fun things today. I, um, they had this thing uh, that is so oddly specific. It was like, um... They had like money blowing around in this little little room thing, and you had to try to grab as much of the money as you could. It was actually really fucking hard, <coughs> and I only got one. And I think she said the most anybody got was I think four or five or something, five or six or something. It was really fucking hard, but it was fun. It was fun doing it, and they also had these huge balls. That's what she said. Any, no, no, no. But they're like big, like boy in the bubble kind of balls. And you could like roll, the two of you would roll around in these big balls. <laughs> I say balls. In these big balls and just try to knock the other person down. So me and my friend, um, oh man, what was her name? See, I'm so bad at people's names because everybody has weird names. Nobody has normal names like Jake or Tom or John or Kim, or anything nice and simple. Everyone has big, annoying, complicated names because parents are so fucking creative. But anyway, she, she, she knows who she is. So we were all set. I was like, oh, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to win this. And I start rolling. Next thing I know, she fucking bonks me. I fall um, to my knees, and I can't get back up, and I'm just like, fuck. So at one point, I just kind of laid down in the bubble thing and was like, I was like, ah, oh, this is actually kind of cool. It, it was really funny. It was really funny. And uh, I played some DDR because they had like a little arcade in the back. And it was very cool because I love arcades. Arcades are so awesome. We really need more arcades in the world. I mean, real arcades, not game systems. I mean, arcades. But, but yeah, it was a lot of fun. I bought some shirts. I, uh, I ate a lot of food because I'm fat. In case you didn't notice, I'm fat just a little. Yeah, I went, um, I went and had some of that delicious guacamole earlier. So fucking good. Anyway, but I digress. So, anyways, guys, um, I think that pretty much covers just about everything. I pretty much posted all the pictures on my Twitter. Sorry, I had to think for a second. I was like, I was about to say Facebook, but I tried to post them there, but the link for some reason wasn't working when I tried to post it on Twitter because my phone hates me for some reason. But, but you know how it is. You know how it is. And I think before I go, I'm going to let Scarlett finish, finish this um, episode. Hello, people! Oh, it's so wonderful to see you guys again. Well, I just had the most amazing time at VidCon this year. And, oh, by the way, I tasted Shane Dawson's nuts. You know what they taste like? Um... Uh, Scarlet, I don't think people want to know what Shane's balls taste like. Oh, they taste like heaven! Heaven! They taste like mm, cotton candy dipped in chocolate, dipped in caramel. Scarlet, are you suggesting that Shane's balls taste like dessert? Yes, that's exactly what I'm saying. 
I, I'm sure Lisa Bug is ecstatic. Please, I'm sure Lisa's never, never nibbled on Shane's balls or ball. Does he have one or two? I don't remember. Oh, God, somebody killed me. Well, Scarlett, just say goodbye to everybody, okay? Because I got to get going. We got to get going to the concert. Fine. She is such a stick in the mud. Scarlett, I heard that. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, it's been a real slice of heaven. I had so much fun at VidCon. Hopefully, I'll be able to come back next year. And I actually have a big announcement. What? I am actually going to start my own channel. My own channel. And I'm going to start doing a weekly show. Uh, uh, Scarlet. 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 No, no, this is not happening. Yes, it is happening, people. It's totally happening. Scarlet. Scarlet. I barely have time to do my videos. When am I going to have time to do your videos? Janet, Janet, Janet. We will find time. Don't worry, guys. And my videos will basically just be me being adored by you guys. Scarlett, nobody is going to watch that. Oh, yeah. Hey, all, all my homies out there, leave a comment below telling Janet you want to see The Scarlet Show on a weekly basis, where I just do a whole video by myself, and Janet just stays in the back being douchey. Scarlet! <laughs> so leave a comment below letting me know what you think, guys. I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it! Oh... I've still got the taste of Shane's balls in my mouth. Scarlet! Ah, oh, Shane's balls. Okay, okay, Scarlet, we can we can stop talking about Shane's balls, okay? We don't need to keep talking about Shane's balls. But everybody wants to hear about Shane's tasty, tasty white chocolate balls. Scarlet! <laughs> There was only one problem. What? You just said his balls tasted like candy. What could possibly have been a, been the problem? <sighs> well, Shane, I didn't want to tell you this before, and I'm sure nobody has ever told you this, but... <clears throat> and I don't mean to sound like some kind of hypocrite, but you have got a lot of fur down there. You might want to trim that shit. Scarlet! What? It's true. You can ask Lisa. Lisa, back me up on this. Hello? Back me up! Oh, Scarlet, leave now before I kill you. Bye, guys. I'll see you later. Ooh, I'm so excited for Disney Day tomorrow! Bye! <sighs> oh my god. Shane, I am so sorry. I do not know what got into her. She is almost as bad as the crazed O2L fangirls. But anyway, guys, this video is already way too fucking long because Scarlet wouldn't shut the hell up. So, um, take it easy and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.